Whether it's David Beckham taking one of his famous free kicks, or whether it's Lewis Hamilton winning the Formula One, or whether it was Steve Jobs about to give one of his famous keynotes, the most underrated skill was this. Visualization, the recreation of images, sounds, and environments before it has happened is one of the most powerful skills in the world. A very powerful meditation and mindfulness practice, visualization has been used for centuries to help prepare the mind, the body, and the consciousness for upcoming challenges, situations, and circumstances. Some of the world's greatest athletes use visualization as a way to prepare for big games, the big day, musicians for their new concerts and tours, and CEOs for their very important meetings. Psychologist Alan Richardson set out to prove the power of visualization through an experiment that I want to share with you today. That's great. Do tell. Richardson gathered a group of basketball players and arranged them into three different groups. The intent of this study was to demonstrate the effectiveness of visualization in how the players converted free throws. Nothing but net. The three groups were as follows. The first group practiced 20 minutes every day. The second group visualized themselves making free throws but didn't participate in practice. The third group did not practice free throws or visualization at all. You don't have to do anything. The results were absolutely staggering. The group that only visualized free throws and didn't practice at all showed marked improvement and were nearly as accurate as the ones that practiced for 20 minutes every single day. What? What it showed is that visualization and the recreation of that moment in time allowed people to prepare mentally to the effect of 20 minutes a day of practice. Now the group that didn't practice or didn't visualize at all naturally regressed. They took a step backward. What this has shown in countless other examples as well is how visualization with action, with practice, can be the formula that we've all been looking for. Often we get forced into action without visualization and although that really gets us going and that practice really does make us perfect that visualization can start the process with more confidence more conviction and more courage